Hi Libras, this is LT Tarot doing your July reading. So it's just a general reading. Um, with that being said, we're gonna pull some cards from my um, my life changes thing and then I'll clarify those cards. But while I'm doing this and pulling out cards, please go ahead and like, comment, and subscribe. Go ahead and give me a thumbs up right now. <laughs> also, um, I do have some church announcements. And basically, um, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna I'm thinking about um starting a spiritual group. So this is gonna be something where if people want free tarot readings, you know, people can uh, offer that service to them. Also, if you're trying to learn something and you want um you're learning something new spiritually and you want a partner to do that, then um you know, my group will actually um, help you with that. Also, it'll be like lessons and stuff like that weekly that we'll learn. And um, if that's something that you're interested in, you can go ahead and send me a um, email because my email is listed below. And um, once you do that, we can go ahead and get started. I just wanted to see what the population would be like, if people will be interested in that. Um, you know, if you'll be interested, sorry, I'm pulling these cards, so sometimes I get carried away with that. But yeah, so if you, um, if that's something you're interested in, then go ahead and send me an email, and um, that'll be something I will get started within the next week or two. But I have to find out if that's what the people want, because I don't want to start a service, and then um, that's not something that, you know, that's one is. Oh, guys. All right. Hold on, hold on. All right. I'm not going to keep you guys long. I know you got things to do, so we'll go ahead and jump right into this reading. So, the first thing first, overall energy that you guys need to get some rest. And you got the nine of water. That's a wish come true card. So, first of all, what I'm picking up is, is that everything you wanted is here. You Getting some rest is manifesting the things you want. So long as you're sitting here manifesting um you're having your wish come true the next thing is is relationship dynamic so you probably are in a relationship or really or you're trying to get in a relationship and um this card is the six of air now either you're you're you have some distance between you and your partner um you could have some distance you can also have, um, you can be having distance as far as the relationship goes, as far as like, you know, conversation wise, like, okay, they're doing their thing, I'm doing my thing, or they could live uh, far away. Um, or you could be literally taking a trip with your partner, um, trying to rebuild a relationship. But I do see that this is the end of a difficult situation for you guys, and things are going to be getting better for you. The next thing. Sorry about that, my phone got cut off. But um, so you have adult children, and then the next thing is strength. So some of you guys have kids that are um, adults, um, and it's like right now, it's feel like you have it's taking a lot of strength for you to, uh, con you know, to deal with them. I feel like there are some issues with your children, maybe you know, a lot of back and forth um, going on with your kids right now, and now I feel like that's also um, affecting this relationship that you're in um but your children are playing a part in your relationship the next thing is sobriety and the night of fire and so that fall, fell into your um your most recent past to your present um so basically there's a lot you know there's some things that are happening quickly and maybe you may find yourself drinking more um, you could, you know, are doing some drug, recreational drugs. Um, 
But, or it is some things, I would say this when it says sobriety. This doesn't necessarily mean any type of drugs or anything like that. It just simply means that things that um, you, you're doing things that doesn't serve you or serve your body. And so you need to take a break from it. Um, because you need to clear your mind, have a clear mind because time is of the essence and things are moving very fast for you right now. Um, the next thing I have is that within the next six weeks, you're at the end of an era. So you're at a, I feel like that's a difficult situation. You're at a, in a diff, uh, difficult situation. You're ending a period in your life and you're moving forward to new things. Um, this, and then you're going to have a lot of wishes. I mean, a lot of things come your way, a lot of options. So, you know, you're just going to have to um, do some research and figure out what option is best for you. The next thing is, it's telling me that you need to keep your faith. And you got, uh, because there is some new exciting um, endeavors that are coming your way. So you need to go ahead and continue to keep your faith and keep pushing forward. There is, you have uh, parental um, care as the second, I mean, not the second one, but as the next one. And then you have the night of air. So basically, you could have some issue, some situation coming on with your parents where you feel like you may need to take care of your parents. Um, also, you know, sorry. Also, it's like you may need to um, carefully review things because you got like there's there's a lot of fast movement in your life right now. So you just want to continue to keep pushing and. Um, know that and take the time to really think things through because you um, do have a lot of um, newness coming your way then uh, your advice card is self-care you could be dealing with Sagittarius because they also have self-care and you guys could be spending your wills a lot and um, you know you guys both need to take care of yourself um, the next thing is is that you probably your one of the self cares you may do, uh, need to do is go back to school learn something new um, but your skill, know that uh, you're, once you take care of yourself, that will be rewarded. There will be a lot of blessings come your way. The next thing here is having forgiveness. Um, you need to work on forgiving. Um, and this is your personal energy. You need to work on forgiving because you have a, um, the three of fire, which means abundance. Things are going to look very, uh, looking uh look very good so there's a lot of blessings coming your way but you have to take care of yourself first so take care of yourself um focus on this relationship and things are going to turn out um you know turn out well for you now um hopes and fears is feeling the spiritual growth and we also have the illusion um sorry the eight of swords which is an illusion of being trapped so I feel like um, you're not feeling satisfied with your religion um, you know and maybe you feel like you're feeling trapped and you, you want to do more as far as like learn on a spiritual level or you feel like your spiritual growth is just kind of like you know basically feeling trapped you or just not a stagnant and you're not having a lot of growth here so what you want to do is you want to focus on that you want to focus on um, doing that I feel like once you start meditating like once you get some rest and start meditating you, you'll figure out your what, what direction you want to actually go into um, and your outcome card is is that you have realization and epiphanies uh oh and you have the three of water you have a lot of celebrations so this is a celebration card um, so you could be having a wedding a graduation a birth announcement that you basically need to have more fun and fun is coming your way and that's probably what you're realize, really you're, you're realizing <laughs> is that you need to have more fun but celebration is definitely on the way with you you have a lot everything that you need is here on the forefront and you just maybe need to be patient meditate while these things are coming to you you're drawing this energy to you but because you have so much good good stuff coming you know don't let go of fear don't um don't hold on to it because everything everything you want is coming to you whatever you call call it out i always tell people call it out you want a new car call out the new car i want a new um camry i want a camry 2019 red um i don't know ain't they lte or something i don't know 
Um, you, that's what I want. Call out what you want. Stop. You know what? I'm going to tell you something. Um, I feel like you can manifest stuff. Um, even when, you know, you can manifest stuff even with, um, when you know, when you're not trying to, I remember saying like, um, my last location, I was like, I'm not going to work here no more. When I get another job, it's going to be somewhere else. I just felt like I wasn't going to work there anymore. And what happened? Like I wasn't even applying to jobs and I got something totally different. And I was like, dang, okay. I manifest that, but I manifest that by just saying like, by basically feeling like, okay, I wasn't going to do something, you know? So be mindful of what you have and in, in your power. It, like you have your own personal power you can grow so much so be mindful of that but anyway guys so we're gonna finish this on the other side um get you some more information on what's going on with your life but you got you're celebrating in the month of july so things are definitely working out for you but we'll talk about um, your celebrations and how to get over so many um, these blocks and stuff like that but yeah you're celebrating in july so go ahead and like Comment and subscribe and I'll see you on the other side. Thank you.